On February 13, 1961, Wallace Lane, Virginia Maxey, and Mike Mikesell were seeking interesting mineral specimens, particularly geodes, for their LM and V Rockhounds gem and gift shop in Oluncha, California. On this particular day, the trio were about six miles northeast of Oluncha, near the top of a peak about 4,300 feet in elevation and about 340 feet above the dry bed of Owens Lake. According to Maxi, they hiked about three miles north, after they had parked some five miles east of State Highway 395, south of Oluncha, California. At lunchtime, after collecting rocks most of the morning, all three placed their specimens in the rock sack Mike Sell was carrying. The next day in the gift shop's workroom, Mike Sell ruined a nearly new diamond saw blade while cutting what he thought was a geode. Inside the nodule that was cut, Mike Sell did not find a cavity as so many geodes have, but a perfectly circular section of very hard, white material that appeared to be porcelain. In the center of the porcelain cylinder, was a 2 mm shaft of bright metal. The metal shaft responded to a magnet. There were still other odd qualities about the specimen. The outer layer of the specimen was encrusted with fossil shells and their fragments. In addition to shells, the discoverers noticed two non-magnetic metallic metal objects in the crust, resembling a nail and a washer.